I knew I was getting close to my pension, and so in November, I notified the company that I worked for that I was turning 65. Well, I could never get a hold of a human resource person. I called two or three times and never got a hold of them. In December, I still didn't receive a check or anything, so I thought, well, I'm gonna try again. So I called him again and told him the problem, and he still wasn't in. So finally, the union person told me about the insurance company that was holding the pension. So I called down there, and the person said they didn't even know of the company. And I thought, uh-oh, here we go. When Mr. Gall came to us, he had been struggling for a few months to get this pension, and we knew that he was qualified to get it. So the first thing I did was reach out to the person that handled the pensions. We chatted on the phone first for a while, and then I sent, I always call it the official letter, because I think that when a plan receives an official letter, then their process starts to happen. And once I did that, it was only a few months before Mr. Gall actually got his pension. The plan worked with us. We had no problems. It was just a matter of getting on the same page and getting him his pension as soon as possible. If it wouldn't have been for the Mid-American Pension Project, I believe that I would still be hung out on a limb somewhere, not knowing if my pension was ever going to come to me or not. Since this program has started in 1998, we have helped over 13,000 people and we've recovered over $67 million in individual pension benefits. There's a lot of people out there that does not have the income like me and I can't afford it to go to a regular attorney. This service was a free service and it's a great service, a great service.